I have animals surrounding me and now jumping on me and I'm trying to film a video. This is mildly difficult. Hey there guys, this is Samantha and today I have my June book haul. I remembered what month it was on the first try. I'm proud of myself. But yes, I'm going to show you all of the books that I bought last month and I'm so excited because I have a lot of them. But yes, this month I'm going to try something a little bit different because my book hauls tend to be very, very long. So instead of describing to you every single book that I get and then just repeating how excited I am about each book, I'm just going to show you and name off every book that I bought this month and then I'm just going to show you at the end which ones I'm the most excited about reading. That should shorten up this mo this book. This That should shorten up this video quite considerably. So yes, well, let's begin. I'm also going to show you the books that I kind of just bought on a whim. So the reasons why I don't really know why I bought these books, but I bought them anyways. So yes, I'm going to have those two categories I'm going to show you guys. First off, let's do the what did she buy this time because I moved it from my wrap up videos to my book haul videos. And honestly, I don't think I really bought anything because I'm still paying for stuff for my animals. This time it was my cat stuff. My cat has had a lot of issues and I've had to fix it. So he was my money pit hole last month. But yes, books. Let's continue. Numero uno is You by Caroline Kess. Dark Lover by J.R. Ward. The Wizard Hunters by Mar Martha Wells. Such a Rush by Jennifer Eck Eccles. Unteachable by Leah Radier. Amy and Rogers Epic Detour by Morgan Matson. My Drunk Kitchen by Hannah Hart. The Girl of Fire and Thorns by Ray Carson. The Girl Who Circumnavigated Fairyland in a Ship of Her Own Making by Catherine M. Valent. T. Valent. The Princess and the Hound by Met Ivy Harrison. Howl's Moving Castle by Deanna Wynne Jones. The Rosie Project by Grammy Simison. The Borgen Betrayal by Sarah Pohl, which I'm pretty sure is actually the second book in a series. Oopsie, didn't know that when I bought it at the thrift store. The Thief of Always by Clive Barker. The Giver by Lois Lowry. One for the Money by Janet Ivanovich. True Sight by David Stair Jr. Weave World by Clive Barker. Bridge to Terabithia by Katherine Patterson. Treasure Island by Robert Louis Stevenson. Shutter Island by Dennis Lehan. Lehane? Something. The First Spider It Chronicles, The Field Guide by Tony Dis. Deter, Lisi, and Holly Black. The 39 Clues by Rick Riordan. Charlotte's Re Web by E.B. White. 19 Minutes by Jody Picoult. My Sister's Keep Keeper, also by Jody Picoult. Gold Diggers by Tasmina Perry. The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe by C.S. Lewis. Sirens by Janet Fox. Nobody Does It Better by Cecily Von Ziegeser. The Short Second Life of Brie Tanner by Stephanie Meyer. Hidden Girl by Shaima Hall with Lisa Waisaki. The Age of Miracles by Karen Thompson Walker. Pray by Michael Creighton. The guy who wrote Jurassic Park. That guy. And then lastly, Lyriel by Garth Nix. But yes, those are all of the books that I bought this month. And now let me show you the books that I'm the most excited about. So firstly, the books that I have no idea why I picked them up. The first one is The Gold Diggers by Tasmina Perry. And this is probably just going to be drama filled. And so I was just excited about drama. So that's why I picked it up. No clue why I picked it up. I don't own it. So I was like, ew, I've never even read this thing. But picked it up. Then lastly, The True Sight by David Steyer Jr. Honestly, I'm probably going to get rid of this right after I bought it because I probably will never read this. Okay, and on to the books that I am so excited about. Yes. The first one I'm going to have to go with, Weave World by Clive Barker. And I don't know if you guys knew this, but I'm absolutely obsessed by the Aberrat series by Clive Barker. And this looks very similar, like basically the adult version of Aberrat. So... I'm super excited to pick this up. Hopefully it's as wonderful as I'm hoping it's going to be. Next is The Girl Who Circumnavigated Fairyland in a Ship of Her Own Making by Catherine M. Valent T. Mostly because of the name. Not going to lie. The name excited me. And I got the last one of these on Book Outlet. I'm not going to lie. I stole the last one. So <laughs> I'm very excited about this. And I've just heard a lot of people talking about it. And 
I'm just so excited. Sorry, I'm trying to fix this little bend in the book. But I'm just... <laughs> then lastly, my, the book I'm the most looking forward to is You by Carolyn Kepps. Kneps? Kepps? <laughs> but yes, I'm so excited about this. This is going to be on my TBR considerably soon because I'm so excited about it. But yes, that is all I have to show you guys today. I hope you enjoyed watching because I sure as hell love talking. I will see you guys next time.